How to put on Comply foam tips on the IE80 and 800S. Now you may be wondering why we're making a video on something as simple as putting an ear tip on an in-ear headphone. Stay tuned, you may be surprised to find something useful here. First the IE80S. To put on the Comply foam tips, it's recommendable to start angled and sort of push the tip on in a curve. The IE80S has a rather long tube, so please make sure to really push the tip all the way towards the end. If it doesn't sit fully on there, that could really mess up the sound. So now when you look at the foam tip from the front, you'll notice the tube might have gotten closed up a bit. That can happen when you squeeze it, so to avoid that, you can sort of peel back the foam towards the headset and away from the tube's ending. That works well, and by doing so, you also compress it, which is what you want anyway. For the IE800S, it's the same thing. But here the tube is very short and thus doesn't provide stabilization for the tip when you put it on. And so it will deform quite a bit, but that's no problem. There's a plastic tube inside the tip itself to make up for that. Here also, start at an angle and squeeze it on in a curve until you feel and hear a subtle click. That means it's on there. And now if you would want to go right ahead and listen to music, you can roll the tip to compress it but again, that could clog up the tube, so here also, peel the tip back a bit to avoid that. Now you can insert the headset. And ideally remember to wait a couple of seconds for the foam to expand. Done! We hope we could solve a problem for you. Enjoy your headset!